to B Division, and this time a classic matchup. It is Reapers against Tropical Depression. Welcome to the RSHL, Daniel Wilson here. Reapers off to a great start with some strong goaltending in that. As he is coming in with probably one of the best percentages we've had so far this season. Depression coming in, had a strong start, fell off a little bit, but they got a chance to at least tie the Reapers in the standings with the B Division. As earlier today, the Zambronis had crushed the Street Force and will now put them in the lead for the time being. But uh, that will probably change. Either the Reapers are going to maintain that lead or we're going to have a three-way tie. So we'll find out. Let's go to the breakdown. We'll start with the Reapers and I am going to keep an eye on Stan Gill and again coming in with one of the best save percentages so far. 97%. That's among the highest. And he, of course, he is facing one of the uh, best goaltenders in the league, Jim, Tr Jim Trebus. And uh, holds a goal against average of just 0.5. That shows how good he is right now, despite the bad season he had in the draft division over the summer. For the depression, I'm going to watch Davis Farrell. Already has four points in the game. And let's see if he teams up with Sam Bonachovitz, who also has four points, but he holds three goals. But I want to see if Davis Farrell can show an all-around strategy. So with that out of the way, we're only just a few minutes from ball drop, and it is up next. Wow. Officials for this game, Tony DiGiacomo at center and Kevin Frost on the boards. So we currently have two of the best goaltenders in the B Division right now. We'll see how they turn out as we now get underway in this B Division round. We backhanded up by Sheridan. And uh, they're going to stop play here because we have a malfunction with the clock. Uh, so that's quite a way to start our matchup. We have a, a malfunction with the clock, so uh, uh, we'll see what they're going to do here. They're going to put the clock at 1350, and now we are underway. Minus 10 seconds. Andrew Livy is knocked back by Tim Corrigan. Along with Ehrman and Levy, we'll cross over. Smith with a shot, saved by Trebus. Nowicki will play it off the board. Over to the guy we're going to watch here. Davis Farrell, that's taken away by Ritter. Ritter trying to split the D, gets through. Shot off the pause, he scores! It rolls in! And Jeremy Ritter gets the first goal very quick. Splits the D and just nice no being had to get close on that, but just squeaks through and the Reapers have an early one nothing lead. And weak shot in as easily picked up by Nowicki. Back and forth they go and here they come the other way. Herdman with a shot just wide of the net. I think it may have got skill and stick as they'll play around the boards and it will be Mark Zaleski upwards to John Ireland. Nowicki will play it off the corner. But instead will be met with Rich and will play it back over to Mel Lewis. Tries a shot just a little wide of the net. Will go behind and they'll try to clear it. Unable, Rich picks it up in the circle. Forced to backtrack, now tries to shot that's blocked. Will stay in play, Nowicki and Billy 
Machete going to the board and we'll be back over to Depression. Farrell tried a weak pass but intercepted by Zaleski. And they'll just clear out and make a change. It will be picked up by RJ Aquilano. Taking a look, and now we'll pass up to. Well, he's going to have to run into Rich, and he'll take it away and over to Levy. Take it away again. It's going to be Hex. And went off of Rich, and he is hurt, and he's going to head to the bench. Yeah, it may have hit something there, and uh, we're going to check on Rich as that ball hit a sensitive spot. Heck, uh, that's going to be the other way with Ritter. Ritter again splitting the D, gets around the wiki, and the slot holds up. Can't get a shot off. A lot of traffic in the slot, pops out. Schroeder with a shot, and that is knocked away. And back the other way they go, over to Hess, but unable to hold on to it. Schroeder, attempt to get to Levy, unable, back to Smith. Levy across the line, just to voice Nowicki, will give over to Ritter. Left circle, holds up, looks at two defenders, tries to pass back to Smith. Smith getting textured, and he does escape with some help from L. Lewis. Tries a shot just a little wide net, and Levy will pick it up on the right circle. Looking at Schroeder. Schroeder with a shot that's blocked. And we'll try to pass upwards. Unable. It's going to be back to Ritter. That was blocked again. Levy with a shot and just missed it. I think it may have, that may have gotten Trebus. I couldn't see from back here. And it rolls towards Trebus and he is going to cover up. Levy was right there, but it just couldn't get enough room to make a shot. Almost there. And Ireland will pick it up. Tries to drop to Machete. Rich. It's going to be back to Corrigan. If you can race down Sheridan, unable, and it'll be back to Rich. Rich out to Ireland. Ireland getting double teamed. Has nowhere to go. Has to give it up to Corrigan. Corrigan tries to go center. Gave it away. Back out it goes. And the depression once again forced back. It tried to get upwards to Corrigan, but instead went off somebody else and it'll go back to Sheridan. We'll play upwards and Aquilano will take it to the corner. Looking at Rich. Weak pass. That was easy pickings for Ireland. He's going to get another chance. Backhand by Machete. And a save by Trevis off the shot from Ireland. And here's Corrigan the other way. Three on two. Tries a shot. He scores! with it, just wound up and somehow got through. Sometimes those kind of shots will get past the goaltender. And Erdman struggling a little bit with that pass, but will get it back up. Trying to get around one defender, but they're forced back. It will tag up as Fox will play it. We'll get a return. Outside slot, try to return pass, but back over to Ritter. Poked by Fox, but back to Schroeder. Levy trying to get across the line. He does, it will drop it to Ritter. Ritter over to Smith. Drops it for Schroeder. Curving shot, but it goes into the corner. Centers up again, unable to handle it. Back to Smith on the right circle, and now here comes the depression out of the way. Poke check by Schroeder, good play. Fox laying down the floor and upwards over to Sam Potashovitz. Levy will take it for the Reapers, crosses the line, looking at two defenders. He doesn't really have any options to go to, is forced to hold it himself. And now we'll backhand it to a Smith shot saved by Trebus. He was just holding on for so long trying to find a lane, but finally found Smith 
And that generated a good opportunity. Sorry, I wasn't thinking. for you, <laughs> That's one by Ireland. Knocked back to the other corner. Hess will just take it to the other corner. Race between Heck and Tro um, Sheridan, rather. Mel Lewis will backhand it, knocked down by Ireland. We'll just loft it out, and Erdman will take a look as he tracks it down. We'll play it upwards over to Heck. Heck trying to cross it, and it'll go back over to Hess. Center's up, nobody there. And Machetti tried to clear, unable, and does get a block off of Corrigan. Machetti trying to get him out of there. And we'll get some help from Ireland, and Rich will play it up to Machetti. Ryan look for another man. It's a shot, but it is offside, and that's going to force the depression all the way back. One by Ritter trying to oh that was deflected off a defender, but luckily Trebus made the stop. Livy trying to get it to Ritter. Ritter still holding looking for a lane. Now forced back to the point. Mel Lewis taking a look. Now I'll try a shot. It goes a little wide. Nowicki picks it up and has to get away from Levy. And now battle on the boards for possession. I see four men down there. It looks like they're going to play up to, to Hess. Hess getting double teamed, trying to get around Zaleski. Tries to set her up. Nobody there. It'll be play, played back down the floor. No icing here because it's stopped by Trevis. And it will be over to Nowicki as he waits for his team to tag up. 440 remaining and we're still at a tie game, one all. And was that a high stick? I'm looking around. I don't see a call anywhere. As a generated opportunity. Oh, missed it wide from Hess. And here's Levy the other way, three on two. Try to up. Zach Smith. Tries another pass, knocked away. Tech will get across the line, but tracked down by Smith. He'll play it out as both teams make a change. They're going to have to make the change quickly, though, because here they come. And Schroeder will play it up to Rich, knocked away, and down the floor it goes. As the Reapers finish their change, as Schroeder will pick it up and will try to get it up to Machetti. Machetti dealing with Corrigan. Now again, double team, here they come the other way. Machetti trying to get back at him. Coop Elias puts it back down the floor as Schroeder will pick it up and will play off the boards over to Rich. It will drop it for Ireland. That fooled the defense. But he's going to hold up and wait for everybody to get on side. And here is Schroeder. And that caught the blocker, and it will be played out. And out it goes as the depression will make a change. It will play upwards, intended for Machetti. And it will be a race down the floor, but it looks like Ryan O'Quinn will pick it up for the Depression. As they will finish the change, and Fox will pick it up for the Depression. Well, I'll have to deal with Mel Lewis, and Rich and Fox fighting for it, but he'll just leave it for Nowicki. Nowicki with a shot, and didn't get all of it as he goes behind the net. Now pops out, Machetti will pick it up for the Reapers. And we'll play it back down the floor, and it will be Nowicki to pick it up in his own corner as the Reapers will once again make a change. And the depression on the attack again, but it's forced back as a, there's a good play by Zach Smith on the fourth check. And he tries a shot as he blocks that one as it will be back to O'Quinn. 
O'Quinn trying to keep control of it, almost lost it to Levy. And the depression just dodged a bullet there, but Mel Lewis keeps the zone. Last to fight with Farrell. Levy will just dump it around the boards, and it will be, it's either going to be O'Quinn or Nowicki. Nowicki will pick it up. Went off a stick, that gives a chance for Ritter. The shot, missed it high. Levy, left circle, trying to look for a call, goes over to Smith. Try center, nobody there. Picked up by Levy. Back and forth they go, and that one deflected off someone, and that would have left opportunity for Zach Smith. And here comes Bonashovitz, and that shot saved by Gillen. Levy now getting double teamed by Fox and Erdman. Yeah! Oh, where did that one come from? The depression has taken the lead as we hit the one minute mark. Two one. That shot came out of nowhere. Gotta see who got that one. to Sam Bonashovitz. And it will be along the wall with 30 seconds remaining in the first. And off the boards, Machetti trying to fight for it, but it will be back across the line to Schroeder. Machetti will play it off the boards once again. Everybody's banking off the boards now. They're going to have to uh, teach a geometry class in just a minute. And back over to Heck. Tries to center to, for Corrigan, but instead we will go to Hess. He's got time for a shot, but it'll miss wide, and that will do it for the first. So, and whoop, and we <laughs> just a little playful uh, jab for, uh, on the corner. But as we head to the first intermission, close game, 2-1, depression. We get ready for the second period, and we just saw what happened to Mike Rich earlier. He actually took a slash to the torso, and it led to Mark. And we took a good look at it, and ouch. And it'll be Ritter winning the draw, and Zaleski will play it upwards to Levy. Tries to deke around. Successful, good pass, backhand, and save down low by Trebus. Toss up, it'll be back to depression. And look out. <laughs> Another toss up back to the depression again. Don't shoot it towards me this time. It's going to be Corrigan. Look at two on two. Didn't get all that shot. He may have topped it. As they head to the corner, Coop Elias. Along with Smith, it'll play back to Levy. Try to pass, that was blocked, and now it'll be up to Ritter. Here we go, here we go! Zach Smith will give a return to Ritter as he looks at Koop Elias. Dodging everyone, and we'll take it to the corner. Gets away from it, centers up! Oh, he missed it high on the one-timer! A great opportunity for Zach Smith and missed it high. Here's Koop Elias back the other way. Does play it ahead, but it'll reach the glove of Gillen and he'll cover. But that was a great opportunity setting up for the one timer. Boy, he just turned on that stick a little too much. Won by a Bonashovitz, and we will be back down the floor. Race between Rich and Farrell. Farrell taking a look. He's going to win that race. Just you, John. And making sure Rich holds up on on his running. 
And gave it away to Justison. Back to Machetti and gave it away. And here they come back the other way. Farrell trying to get around Schroeder, unable. Ireland waiting for Rich to tag. He does. Rich picks it up on the drop pass. Tried the shot way wide of the net as Trevis was thinking about covering, but he was just too far away to get it. Here's Farrell, three on two. Looking at Justin and Schroeder, passes left. Look at that shot, saved by Gillen, and everybody gangs up on him, but Gillen covers. No, I'm ready. I need a second. I'm like, you guys actually ran. Hey, I'm here. And one by the impression shot by Arquilano fighting through a bunch of bodies. And so he picked up on the corner. Looking at Bonashovitz. And to the opposite corner, Farrell picking up along with Justison. Back out it goes to Rich on the top of the circle. Pass right over to Schroeder. One coming, one coming. Nice. Here's Rich. Do it again, do it again, Mike. Enough. Rich, look at that double team, gets it away to Schroeder. He'll play it down the floor, over to Machetti, and that one's stopped by Travis. Off the deflection. Go reverse! That's normal, I think I hit you Face off. Uh, that's a toss up. Race for control is going to be Lewis with control. Now playing off the boards. Here's Ritter trying to get control. That ball far away from his stick. And now get it away over to Levy. Looking at RJ Aquilano. Trying to decide where to go. Now gets it away to Smith. He scores on the backhand! And it ties it up. The back end off the post, and the Reapers have tied it up at two. Andrew Machikas. And that'll be won by the Reapers as we are now not at all up again. Here's Smith with another shot saved by Trevis. And whoa, that one, that one got loose, but the whistle already blew. Yeah, Trebus was thinking about getting up and he may have lost sight of the ball, but the whistle saved him. Upwards to Corrigan. And Smith will take it up, tries backhand pass. Back before they go, Corrigan will hop it around and will take it to the right side. And going down, and a penalty being called against the Reapers. And it's going to be a tripping call. And maybe going against Zach Smith. Michael, just shoot me. I'll pray for a rest. Go yellow! That's a trip. So the clock at 7.55. As the depression will now go on the first power play of the game. Won by the depression, Urban, upwards to Heck. Looking around and try to set her up to Bonachovitz, he scores! And Bonachovitz with his second of the game. And a power play goal puts him up three to two.
And one by the Reapers by Bonashovitz gets it quickly and a 6 8 by Gillen. Bonashovitz will pick up his own shot. He'll try to set her up. Knocked away by Gillen. Back to the point. Come on, Billy. Is there trying to keep it in play? Heading nice, to the corner and Ireland tries to set her over to Rich. That pass went awry and now he's having to deal with some back checking. Billy, get in the net. And now back over to Zaleski. We'll give a return to Ireland and that was blocked. Knocking around. As Zaleski trying to hold it up, but it will be back over to Schroeder behind the line and everyone forced to tag. Go, go, go. Here's Ireland with a shot high and wide off the back of the net. And will be picked up by O'Quinn. He'll play around the boards. Erdman. Upwards to Bonashovic. Looking at Schroeder back. It goes across the line there, forced offside. And now look at a chance shot and a save. That shot from Derek Holt. And we'll just dump it down the floor. 2-1-0, As Ryan O'Quinn will pick it up in his own end and we'll play it up over to Derek Holt. And he'll just dump it down the floor as well. Stay there, Eric, stay there. Farrell on the left circle. Setters up for core again. Shot save with the stick by Gillen and he covers. And toss up for control. Reapers have it. It's Mel Lewis. Walking up slowly, looking at Corrigan. We'll play upwards intended for Ritter, but down the floor it goes. And RJ Aquilano will pick it up for the depression. Trying to clear it up the floor, but he's going to have to raise Justison. And he'll just play it up to Mel Lewis. We'll cross it over to Levy as everybody tags up. I'll play left over to Zach Smith on the left hand board. Shot saved by Trevis. He covers with 437 remaining in the second. Another toss up. It looks like Ritter has it. Back over to Mel Lewis. Winding up, tried shot, didn't get all of it, but Trevis makes the save anyway. Here's Nowicki, looking at Levy and Ritter. He'll be forced to dump it around, and he'll be picked up by Farrell. Intercepted by Smith, good play on the four check. Here's another shot, just a little wide off of Ritter. And down the back it goes, unable to hold the line. Now, Justison forced to get it away, and we'll get it back over to Mel Lewis. And now is forced to dump it, but they're offside, and they just called it. Yo, good. They were, they jumped a little too early as Corrigan goes down, and oh boy, it looks like he may be shaken up. Hey, yeah, uh, Corrigan's head, heading to the bench. This would be a big blow to the depression as an offside is called against the Reapers. I don't know what happened to Corrigan there, but if that would be a big blow if they lose him. And backhanded, will be picked up by Mel Lewis, will just drop it. And it was intended for Mike Rich, but it gets by him and down floor goes over to Bill Nowicki. Oh, interception by Ireland, but he left without the ball. But he does get it back. Back over to Sheridan, try to shot. And a breakaway the other way for Bonashovitz. Back in. Oh, he missed it wide. He had Gillen beat, but a little too sharp of an angle. As everybody fighting for it along the boards, Ireland does push it across. 
And he'll just jump it back down the floor. Sheridan forced to pick it up. And he'll pass it upwards over to Ireland. But a great breakaway chance off the block shot. Here is Mike Rich taking it away as everybody races in. Rich trying to get it back, but unable. And over to Von Schulman. Hess on the left point. And now I'll give a return to Von Schulman. Trying to pass. That's blocked by Vichetti. Centers up. Nobody there. Picked up by Hex. Centers up again. Intended for Von Schulman, but blocked by Vichetti. Go all the way. And back and forth on the stick. Ritter and shot. Close save by Trevis. All right, the good news for the depression is that Corrigan is back on the floor, so it wasn't as serious as we thought. With one minute remaining, Toss up for control, and Ritter has it. Ritter trying to center up in the slot. Over to Levy, has to control it, and now forced it into the corner. And now Ritter trying to buy some time as it'll be played up across the line, but Schroeder's gonna, whoa, it went off of Hex. That was a lucky break, but here they come the other way. Ritter. Leaves it for Levy, with 30 seconds remaining. Gave it away over to Hex. Off the stick, and back up to Levy for the reverse, with 20 seconds remaining in the second. Tries a shot, that's blocked, but it gets to Smith. Oh, he left without the ball. He does get it back. Trying to find any kind of control. As he's now forced to go behind the net. Ritter going down along the back end. No penalty called here. Back at it, and that's how the period ends. The Reapers wanted a penalty, but none called. But everything is calm between Ritter and Corrigan. As we head to the second intermission, deficit still the same. Three to two after two. Third period, just about ready. As uh, during the break, Schroeder was uh, trying to get an explanation of why there wasn't a penalty call there. But it's still anyone's game. Still one goal deficit in favor of the Depression. And off we go. It will be won by the Reapers. As Justison upwards over to Ireland. Quick shot wide of the net. Nowicki trying to clear, unable. Justison tries another shot high at the net. Will be picked up by Rich in the opposite corner. But looking at Aquilano, he's got to get rid of it. Does, goes over to Ireland. But lost it over to Kupalias. And now here's Bonashovitz. He tries a shot, that's blocked. Another chance. There's another one, and that one wide the net. Shot coming from Holt. Sheridan. Trying to look for any kind of help, and he does in the form of Mike Rich. Rich with a shot, high and wide, as it's stuck behind the net. As Machetti trying to dig it out, but is having to deal with Aquilano. And now Machetti is going to head to the corner. Oh, trying to get a one-timer off of Rich, but he whiffed it. Over to Ireland, left circle. Try to look for something. Now gets over to Rich with a shot wide of the net. Vichetti will pick it up. Try center. Nobody there. Picked up by Nowicki. And Mel Lewis tried to glove it down. He was unable. As Goop Elias is now fighting with him for it. it looks like Elias has control. Over to Holt. Try to pass to Bonashovitz. He's got a chance. He scores! Bonashovitz gets the hat trick. And it will get him up for the two. accumulated his very first RSHL points. 
That's a big step with any player in the league in your first point. As Schroeder will play it upwards over to Smith. And we'll lob it over to Levy. Levy looking for any kind of lane. We'll hopped off a foot as Zach Smith will play behind the net. We'll give it over to Levy in the left corner. And now we get to return to Smith. Pops out. Nobody there at the point. That's going to be a chance for Fox. Shot. Glove save. And it hops over behind the net over to Zaleski. Trying to get rid of it. Picked up by Farrell. Farrell. Trying to fight off Zaleski and now runs into Zach Smith. Back to the corner. Smith trying to move in. And now having to fight for control, but it's back over to Ritter for the Reapers. Has to get away from Erdman. And wow, he took a slash. He is down. We got a man down behind the play, and they're going to whistle it as Jeremy Ritter took a big slash, but there was no call. And Ritter is gonna to head to the bench. We'll have to look at that and see what happened here. But it looked like that uh, they were both fighting for it. Jeremy, you good? So the clock has stopped at 10.51 as we get back underway. Back down the floor, it'll be Schroeder to pick it up. Get over, guys. Levy. Holding up. Waits for a lane, decides to go to Schroeder. Schroeder tries backhand, intercepted by Fox. There's Farrell trying to get around Levy. Levy picks it up the other way. Erdman trying to fight back. Now gets it back up to Farrell, and that shot is blocked. Tries again, this time blocked by Schroeder. Corrigan with a shot, that's blocked. Another chance, that's wide. Zach Smith will go behind over to Schroeder. And almost intercepted by Corrigan as Mike, Mike Rich getting triple teamed. Here's Levy up in front. Couple of chances and both of them stopped by Trevis. And toss up, it'll go to the depression. Hecht will play down the floor, opposite corner. Eric Justison will chase it down. Off the boards, Machetti. I'll just dump it to the opposite corner, but that's gonna leave Ryan Erdman with control. With approximately nine minutes remaining in the third period. Here in the call, gets it to Hess. But knocked away by Justison and back down the floor it goes as the depression get back on side. Up towards to Hess. But looking at Ritter who's back in the game. Now they'll try again. This time they'll just dump it. One on good! Looking at Sheridan. And here comes Hecht to the left, I'm sorry, right corner. Ireland will turn around, take a look. Tries to bank it off the board to himself. Now getting double teamed. Ritter moving in, trying to give him some help. And back across the line it goes. And we picked up by Heck. Over to Hess. You hear Justice in making the call. And we'll lob it, intended for a machete. As O'Quinn gives it some help and gets it out of the zone. Sheridan will play upwards over to Ritter at center. Gets rid of it in time over to Smith. Tries a low shot, perhaps looking at a screen. And it will be over to Sheridan once again, backhanded over to Ritter, left circle. Looking at Erdman, gives him a good shove and he has control. And Hess came in offside, his feet came in first. With seven and a half remaining in the third. 
Go, boys, line up. Okay, you should have a And one by Ritter and a quick shot saved by Trebus. Off the foot of Ritter. And this could be a breakaway. Here comes Elias shot and an aggressive move by Gill and he makes the save. And he makes another one but left it wide open but gets some help by Zaleski. And down the floor goes, no icing here. Aquilano and Smith racing for it. And just to roll that ball gives it in favor to Aquilano. There's a chance, he scores! This one looks like it's gonna go to Andrew Levy. We'll try to get the official word on this award, but the Reapers have put it back within one. So yes indeed it was Andrew Levy that scored the goal. And now gets his team within one. Levy will just chip it to the opposite corner. Around the boards over to Zaleski looking at Corrigan. And now both of them fight for it. Corrigan going down. Quick shot. And saved by Trebus. Just a hard fought play. And a great shot from Zaleski. Um, <laughs> One by Rich, but almost gave it away. Here's Rich with a shot, goes wide of the net. Machetti on the uh, left end boards. <laughs> Machetti once again trying to find Nowicki. Nowicki with a bigger size gets control and will be over to Fox. Gets across the line, now has to race Schroeder. Fox gets control. Fox, weak shot, easy save for Gilwin. Here's Mike Rich, man, has to look out for Farrell. Farrell with the control, tries to shot, that's blocked. Over to Corrigan, and a good play by Schroeder to knock it away. And now Levy with control, as he'll be we're considering options, gets away from Fox. Now drops it to Machetti. Machetti will just dump it behind the boards over to Mike Rich. Rich intended for Machetti, but Machetti was heading towards the slot and back out it goes. No icing here. Justin off the boards. They weren't ready though and back down it goes as he'll just leave for Justison. Justison will just walk it up and with about four minutes left, they're gonna have to start putting some pressure on. Back down to Sheridan, we'll pick it up off the board. Looking at Hess as a one change. And Hess had it temporarily, but it'll go back to Ritter. He's gonna try, try to have to bring some speed on this one. Crosses, intercepted, back the other way to Hess. He's looking at one defender, tries a shot wide of the net. It'll be knocked away by Justison and Hess will pick it up again. Hess, whoa, look out, big size from Zach Smith, almost took him down. As Hess, uh, passing to no one and Ireland will pick it up. But back down it goes to Hex, looking at Sheridan as we approach the three minute mark. Watch the middle. Tries a shot wide of the net as Justison will play it off the boards over to Zach Smith. And, and that hits the ceiling and that is going to stop the clock at three minutes. And it's going to be won by the Reapers, and they are trying to dump it down the floor as Bonashovitz will pick it up. He can no longer score this game. 
and he'll just dump it, but it hits the ceiling with the clock stopping at two. Well, the clock is still running, but the, the clock should be stopped. Uh, we'll see if they put some time back on the clock. Yeah, they're gonna stop it at 2.48. And back over to Levy, shot wide of the net. As Elias trying to clear it out, picked up by Zaleski. Zaleski again, triple teamed. He goes down, no call from anybody. Back down the floor it goes as Gillen will squat it over to Zaleski. Has to get away from Koopa Elias with 2.27 remaining. It rolls back to Gillen, drops it off. And intended for Rich, but they do get across the line, so the depression are forced offside. As they will just return to sender and back over to Zaleski with 2.07 remaining. A good play by Ritter, giving himself some room. But he has to find a lane for any help. Back down the floor it goes, a race for control. But it is going to be an icing against the Depression. 155 remains. And the Reapers are going to call a timeout here with 155 remaining. It's been a very close game so far. And of course, they can expect Von Schulbitz to stay on defense since he can no longer score. So with 155 remaining, we're going to have to watch Dan Gill and see when he's going to be coming to the bench. So at this point, who do you put on the floor? Andrew, you want me to go out now and you fit, uh, I'll run for a hard for about 55 to catch up? Or you want to start? You want to do that? I'm good now. You do have Andrew Levy who has two for the game. And that puts him up to three points for the, for the season. Jeremy Ritter um, has scored a goal today. Yeah, that puts him up to three goals and he does have an assist to his credit. So it looks like you would uh, see Andrew Levy and uh, definitely uh, Jeremy Ritter on the floor. And I would definitely be uh, looking at Zach Smith on this one. Big guy, he has generated scoring opportunities before. He has some chances this game off a couple of one-timers, but unfortunately he either didn't get a shot off or he has missed. So if he can adjust his stick work, he could definitely put that tying goal in. As the Depression win this face off, Nowicki tries to clear, that's blocked. Tries again, intercepted by Smith, and that one wide of the net. Levy heading to the corner, trying to keep control for the Reapers, but back down the floor goes, and that's going to reach Gill, and he is forced to drop it off to Sheridan. Hustle, hustle! Be quick. And the Reapers making it clear that they're not going to waste any time. Everybody heading to the line and back to Aqualano. He'll just dump it back down as Sheridan will return it over to Ritter. Lost control. And that's just going to waste time for them. And Gillen at some point is going to have to come to the bench. And watch out, here comes one. And it'll be back over to Ritter. We get around the wiki, does. Gillen walking towards the bench. And here he comes. Gillen is off the net and six on five now being played with less than a minute remaining. And now the, uh, oh, good steal by Zaleski. Try to center up, but gave it away. Oh, he gave it away. Here's a shot, that's blocked. A lot of traffic in the slot. Point, 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 point. Tries another shot, that one blocked, and that will stop the clock at 36 and a half. There was a lot of traffic in front. Now while that had a bit more coverage, that would mean that they would be screening uh, Trebus. So that's a double-edged sword that they're playing with. 
And as the Reapers are just making one last change. Heading to the corner, Ritter. Tried to get it back to Rich. Drops off for Ireland. Can they get control? A lot of traffic rounding then. And that one stopped right in front of the net. Out it goes. They're gonna have to hurry to the line. 20 seconds remaining. Here's Rich. Gets away from one. Here's Ireland. Gets away from Corrigan. Left corner. Trying to center. Unable. Glove down at the point. Eight seconds. Shot. That's blocked. Up in the air. Still loose in the corner. Three seconds remaining. They're gonna have to shoot it now. Shot. Wide the net and the depression. Escape with a 4 3 win. How do you like that? A hard fought ending, but the depression survived the onslaught and will come away with a 4 3 win and will now create a three way tie for first place. So now both teams go to 2 and 1 along with the Zambronis. But there's still plenty of season left for someone to grab that top spot. We'll be back for the wrap up. A hard fought game between these two teams, but it ended up being Sam Banashovitz with a hat trick, once again showing his prowess on the offense, and that just overwhelmed the Reapers this time around. So in the future, it looks like the Reapers are going to have to keep an eye on Banashovitz, who has it scored four goals in the spring uh, final game, and it has just been a phenom among the team. So we will see what happens throughout the remainder of the season with three teams now holding first place with a two and one record. So that'll do it for this game. We'll have a lot more games for you coming up from XL Sports World this day, Wilson. We'll see you next time around. The RSHL is supported by AllBlackHockeySticks.com, the stick of choice for many players of the RSHL. It is a very light and durable stick for only $89. AllBlackHockeySticks.com